Tonight, WDSU investigates and covers new documents linked to the Lawrence Hecker case. The 92 year old retired New Orleans priest accused of rape and kidnapping. WDSU investigative reporter Aubrey Killian breaks down the new records and what it could mean for Hecker's upcoming trial date. That's right. In these new records that we just obtained from criminal court, they say Hecker has dementia and his ability to testify. It will be impacted. The new report describes Hecker as disheveled and impaired. He has a mild facial droop, suggestive of a stroke. They say Hecker stated he thought he might be in a mental hospital, then later corrected to the courthouse. He stated he was there to, quote, clear up my case. The report also says his cognitive abilities will continue to deteriorate. He is also likely to have bad days, which he can't focus. The report goes on to say that this would negatively affect his ability to listen and his ability to testify. DA Jason Williams spoke moments ago about Hecker. I have not seen anything in any of his reports that suggests that he is not competent to stand trial as it relates to the Bennett criteria as laid out uh, by, by, by court jurisprudence. Uh, there's, um, I mean, he's an old man. I'm an old man. My shoulder hurts sometimes, right? I forget things sometimes, but uh, Lawrence Hecker can stand trial and it's time for him to do it. Judge Ben Willard is expected to decide if Hecker is competent this month. Back to you.